Hey, so like the title said, this is my six month progress video of me learning the cello, but I just wanted to do a quick intro to provide a little bit of context. Um, I am actually like a complete beginner and not just with the cello, but with music in general. I had, was like never in band, never played any other instruments. That was a gift when I was a kid and I tried to teach myself and it did not work out. My heart was always with the cello and it wasn't just until recently that I like was able to and had the, uh, um, I guess the motivation to go out and seek lessons. So that's what I've been doing. Um, the three books that I have been learning with are uh, Offer Strings, um, book one for cello. Uh, the Suzuki Cello, book one, super common Suzuki to, for classical string instruments. And also the Klengel or Klengel, uh, Technical Studies for the Violin, for Cello, Violin Cello, um, Volume 1. So at any given point with the progress that you see, it will be from those three books. Um, I started learning the cello on November 8th of 2019, and it is currently... I'm filming this a little late, so it's April 19th of 2020. So with all that said, thanks for watching, and uh, I'm going to keep it short so that your ears don't bleed too bad. Okay, thank you. to be. <laughs> it sounds like it. This is the theme. This is like literally the easy way to play it. It's just like one note at a time. <laughs> the full music is like... playing for like three weeks you need to <laughs> calm down <laughs> you're lucky i can even do this
So I do feel like I have improved a lot. I still feel like I sound like garbage, which I think is actually kind of fine, Ooh. considering that I've only been playing six months. So I did want to go over some things that I think uh, I've seen some improvement with and things that I definitely still need to work with. Um, so one thing that was really hard for me starting off was like the bow hold, the bow hold um, which I don't know why it was just like not intuitive for me at all to actually hold the bow in any sort of like proper way. I think my teacher like had me start with like my pinky up here just to like get some, just to get a little bit uh, comfortable with it. But this like feels completely fine now and it's, it's like, I feel like I have my groundings. Um, Actually like pressing the notes and holding them, I thought that would be like the one of the harder things to do and it's actually been tough to like be completely um my inton the intonation is tough but in regards to like actually being able to play the notes that hasn't been as bad as i thought it would be what's really hard for me right now is actually rhythm i don't have that so that's been really tough my uh teacher always bugs me to play with the metronome and it's super hard for me to do because it like confuses me um, when you play cello, you're just like focusing on so many different things at once that like just like having the metronome in the background is just like one extra thing for me to like try to focus and play on and it's really been throwing me off. But generally within this last, within these last six months, I have essentially finished All for Strings book one and I am currently on like the last song of the Suzuki, um, cello school book one which is like a very very common learning book but uh i've really been enjoying it it's been incredibly challenging but uh very fun uh, i feel like my intonation's off but then if i look at my intonation then i'm not looking at the notes and i lose my spot on the sheet and if i lose my spot on the sheet then the whole thing's ruined but then if i don't look at my hand and don't check if my intonation is correct then my intonation off so then i get through the notes but then the notes are off